different people. Which you hear. Just a quick video. It's a very high tide today down in the south of England. About 5.1 metres with a bit of a storm surge. I'm just down at Port Creek Junction out here, obviously. And the water in the creek is obviously tidal. Right up to the bottom of the touching the bottom of the railway bridge there. Low tide, you can walk underneath there. No chance of that today. Very high, it's right up. That's, that's, that's the footbridge, it's right up to the bottom of the footbridge there. It's blowing a gale too. This is the water's right up, right up on the slipway there. Not far off going up the subway. You can see how high it is. Not far from the top of the little wall. London bound train from Portsmouth going across the bridge there. So on the other side, you can see how how high it is there. Walks right up over the, the footpath. at low tide or lower tide that water over that's hillsy moat that's not tidal that's just like Little sort of more like a little moat, fresh water, semi fresh water. That's not tidal, so that does goes up and down with like rainfall. It's going under the railway bridge now. This side you actually get underneath where the little moat is. You actually get underneath it. So. Footbridge there, you can get over just across the water if you want. Yeah, hi, it's there, in the up, in the up to the top of the bank. All these rocks you can see there, they're, they're extra like sea defences. They were put there about five, four, five years ago to like shore up the bank. There's only some sort of mud bank along there. They were put there just for this purpose to stop the mud being eroded at high tide. Any new little footpath they put in here, when they say when they raised up the raised up the shoreline. So I'm like the other side now. That's that's looking east, up towards the Eastern Road area. I'm not going to go right up there at the moment. Quite a long way up there.
one of them people.